going on everybody? It's Titanic Feet Jack and I'm back at you again with another video. I would like to welcome you guys back to the channel. This is your first time here and want to be part of this channel. I ask that you hit that subscribe button. Also, I need a favor, hit that like button. Drop a comment on today's video. Let me know what you think of the video and the sneaker we about to take a look at. Now today we got an early review for you guys. This sneaker uh it released overseas. They had the uh, Nike sneakers day overseas, and it shot drop on that day. But they have not released here in the U.S. I believe the release date is gonna be in December, but that's to be announced due to uh, pushbacks and the recent uh, vandalism of the trailers at the uh, Nike warehouse here in Memphis, Tennessee. Uh, this sneaker is a women's sneaker, but uh, I believe that's just my opinion. One of the reasons they got pushed back some was they uh, decided to put the sneaker in extended size to allow people like myself to get a pair for the tote. This sneaker was one of the sneakers that was stolen from the Nike warehouse in those trailers as nice kicks and everybody posted those photos and videos and they have been circulating around the internet. Without further ado, let's get into it. Here you go, Jordan box. You see the flight, red John Jumpman, black top. Got that paint splatter going around the bottom. Here you go, that's your box label. This is in women's sizing, so we're gonna read the box label to you. It says women's Air Jordan 4 Retro. Color is canyon purple, safety orange. Women's size 16.5, which is a men's US size 15. And the reason I got size 15 lately, the Jordan Retro 4s and the Retro 3s, they've been running snug, so I've been having the upsize on those. Now here you go, the inside of the Jordan Retro Full Box Top. We got some goodies here. These came from a uh, GOAT. This cam, this cam with the item is a paper. It says uh, the Jordan Retro Full Cam Purple in the size and it says ship by. It appears DHL was supposed to deliver this, but it was delivered by FedEx. We also have gold sticker in here. Had to reach out to Uncle Billy Goat again. And your authentication card. There you go. Looking inside the box. You glossy on one side paper. And we do have a YDM sticker right here. Inside the box. Right there. Let's look at the sneakers. Here we go, guys. We have the Air Jordan Retro Full Canyon Purple, the women's sneaker that came in extended sizes. For me, and probably a lot of other people out there in the sneaker community, this is the closest we we're gonna get to that Travis Scott 4. He has a purple 4 that came out, and the prices are just way up there in space. It's a price that hardly anybody wants to pay so this is the next best thing we're gonna get into it we got a thick cup suede thick cup there y'all go look how thick that suede is the majority of the upper is purple suede that long suede you have your purple cage right here with black behind it and you got your wing extender right here in black and you have your your hits right here it looks green, but look a little closer. It does have a greenish tint to it. Same for your midsole. That same right here with paint splatter all over it on those two parts. You got your black hit right here on your midsole. And you got that white hit right here around your air housing. And you have a uh, clear bubble with white on the inside. And another hit of that green light green material right there was leads you to your outsole you got your herringbone traction on your outsole you got the white hit here and there you got black hits right there and you have that green going on right here 
with a safety orange Jordan Jumpman. Looking at the heel of the sneaker, the back tab of the sneaker is black and you have a Jordan Jumpman on here. There's nothing behind that tab and we're going to look at the medial side of the sneaker. You have more of that thick cut, nappy suede. You got your black wing extender or whatever you choose to call it right there. And you got your two little hits right here that greenish look like waffles or whatever you call those. You got your purple cage with the black behind it supporting it. And again on the midsole, that greenish tint with the paint splatter on it. Your white hit right here going around your air housing clear bubble with the white inside. And you got that hit of black right here. And you have your stars along here. That's what you have on your folds, your stars right here. And here's a look of the toe box. Give you guys a better look of that sleeve. Here's a close up. There you go, kiss the suede. And we have the uh, netting going all the way up to like right here on the tongue. Comes factory lace with uh, the flat canyon purple laces. You have the black behind the cage. And we have a woven patch, black woven patch right here. Total orange Jordan Jumpman and flight on here. More of that nappy suede and it's a high cut tongue because you cannot see the color of the material behind the tongue. I'll help y'all out spin that around. Total orange behind the tongue. Woven patch Air Jordan is upside down as usual. These do come with a second set of laces and those are attached to the left sneaker. And here you go right here. These how your laces should come if you have an authentic pair black laces so you got black flat laces and the front and the canyon purple laces that these come laced with also uh it comes stuff with tissue which is a little different and this is the insert guys canyon purple insert closer look total orange jaw jump man and here we go we have that insert again, that Dream Cell insert. So that's what it's going for. On the Cane Purples are, these are my Travis Scott Four guys. So what do y'all think about these? Sizing on them, fours, like I said earlier, fours been running small lately. So I definitely would go a half a size up at minimum. Or if you got big feet like me, size 14, the only way to go is up. You got to get a 15. So here it is. Side 15 or 16 and a half women. So let me know your thoughts on today's sneaker. Uh, if you plan on copping when it releases in December. If that date stands. And I'm going to end the video. Like I always tell you. If you can help somebody get a sneaker. Help them get that sneaker. Because you never know. It will be your turn to need help getting the sneaker. I'm Titanic Feed Jack. Signing out.